Is it a perfect day outside right now? No, it's not. It's rainy. It's gloomy. It's not a nice June morning where it should be sunny and bright and glorious outside. But you know why it is a perfect day? Because I got part two of this Age of Empires 2 Conqueror's Expansion walkthrough coming out for you guys. Taking place in the Attila Hunt campaign. And the first part to this walkthrough, I uh, got this mission going and set the... Uh, set the stage for what is to come against the Scythians, the Western Roman Empire, and those blood enemies, uh, the Persians. Or actually, is that Western Roman Empire? Not sure. Uh, but you gotta cut me some slack still. I'm still not totally refined in my commentating skills quite yet. I'm gonna have to work that out. And uh, it's very stressful playing while commentating, so you're going to have to take into account that sometimes the gameplay isn't great. So just enjoy the ambience, enjoy the game. Um, and we'll be moving on to some greater things in this mission. Once I do some uh, serious work in scouting out and building up my own defenses. So right now we're going to start by scouting out. We're going to take a peek over here. There is a Persian camp right there. A mining camp along with a wall and a guard tower that uh, we do not want to assault yet um, because that guard tower could take out our Tarkins. We don't want that. Um, and what you want to do, actually, if I if I repair them, which I will in a second here, after I build up these uh, the stone wall, uh, you can actually take out the that that. Uh, we raise this Roman camp to the ground. Quite amazing it is because that was put there by the creators of this game. You don't realize. That's actually fixed into the game, so um, don't feel too proud of yourself. Sorry, get a little freeze action there. Computer's still adjusting to this um, trio of programs that run at one time. So I'm going to crank out a couple of these villagiers. And you want to build up this stone wall. Once again, don't put the stone wall over there. You're not Stonewall Jackson. We're not referring to you as Stonewall. Huns. I don't even know why the Huns can build the gates. Or the wall. Aren't they kind of gothic? They're nomadic. You don't build stone wall. Whatever. So, um, first things first. We're going to plop down a... Oh, not enough stone, apparently. Well, that's not going to be for too long, because I'm going to sell off this guy. Let's see. Buy 100 stone. Sounds like a good trade-off villager created you're gonna be doing some labor for me and once you get this gate down um, you can heal up these Tarkins once you get a castle down and then you can have the Tarkins assault this gate uh, you want them fully uh, with full health and a good thing is to have the watchtower target Attila because he will slowly get healed and your Tarkins will be the to assault that um, watch uh, guard tower eventually so it's a good strat all in the end all right so we're gonna plop down that castle right there it's a little tight a little tight in the real estate, didn't do a great job in designing my base. Already getting off to a bad note in base design. I know if there's one thing that really really annoy people is that I don't queue up farms and that I don't um, have good base design. But, you know, there's some flaws in my play. I'm going to admit it. I'll be the first one to admit it to, admit it to you. There are flaws all over the place. Alright. So, in a second... I don't believe you want to um, make sure you get all these resources. Holy crap! Who are you firing at? What are you doing, guard tower? Do you realize that that villager won't hurt you whatsoever? And there are no people in that guard tower. I don't even know how you're shooting out of there. Is it black magic coming already? Black magic, Persian black magic, even worse. Nebuchadnezzar. Oh my gosh! All right. Let's pull that card right away. So I'm going to kill you guys with my Tarkins. Chicken Wings to the rescue. Chicken Wings 101. Well, that goes. there goes one of my Tarkins. And Villager, why not get in the fray? Go ahead and be that big guy. BMOC. All up in the heezy. Alright, so this castle's finally doing a service. After uh, about 10 or 5 years... 10 or 5, 5 or 10 years of construction. Sounds like a construction around my uh, city. Oh, they're going to be uh, doing some construction on our street, which means they're going to be doing some construction on your street for the next 9 decades. 
That's too far away. Well, that's a buzzkill. Hey, go for my watchtower all you want. I'm gonna build some fletching. Alright, no, that's not what I want. Alright, keep getting some stone there. You guys, be useful. Farm. Farm for me. Alright, I'm gonna plot down another mill action. I don't want them to be trekking all across my base. Villager. I got villager, uh, rancid villager all over my base. Hate the rancid villager. Rancid complaining villager. Alright, so now is the time to take advantage of this castle and its healing powers. Its medicinal powers. Love the stone. We're gonna get a hand cart going. I'm a little slow if you if you haven't already picked up on that, on my reactions to things. So, um, I cut me some slack. And now, I don't know if it's still, still not enough range. Alright, good enough. Alright, attack that guy, and once you take that thing down, um, once you take that down, you can rush in with your Tarkins and take care of whatever, uh, that guard tower, and use that gold for yourself, so that is nice. Alright, I'm gonna queue up some farms just to quiet those complainers. Plop you down. Mills to the ready. Uh, screw them. I'm not going to be using really any soldier, foot soldiers in this mission. Oh, uh, something caught your attention. I realize you've stopped firing on this wall. Um, uh, sir. This wall can be continued to fire upon. Uh, that is a very poor decision on your part to not listen to my orders. You're lucky I don't go over here and press the button in the top right hand corner of my keyboard. It's called Delete. Very lucky that very lucky you are. Alright, so that stone mine's almost in the ready. You're in a mansion. Alright, not enough gold. Of course I don't have enough gold. Never have enough gold in my life. Once. Never lived a second of my life playing this game without enough gold. Not enough food either. Well, isn't this some kind of sort of depression I'm not uh not aware of? Alright, let's go. Let's speed up the process. Alright, alright, alright. I like the sound of that. You can start working on that. And um, pretty soon here, you're gonna join those fellows in uh, Lumberjacks and Lumberwomen. Timbered it up. And then pretty soon, we might be get some deadliest catch over here by the shoreline. Maybe not, though. I don't know if it's that exciting. It's a good show, by the way. Alright, so now is the time. Oh, Tarkin's. Let's take a while, I guess. Let's take a while. And we're going to have to wait a little bit because these guys don't have the greatest healing power, medicinal power as this castle, so we're going to have to wait a little bit longer. And you're going to join these guys over here doing some work. Alright, we have enough lumberjacks and enough farmers. So pretty soon, um, we're going to have enough stone to build another castle and some more walls. But only after I get some more gold over here. So do work. Alright, so I'm going to put you over here. You're useless standing there. Whoa! A pickaxe on the farms. Isn't that threatening to your, threatening to your fellow villagers? I don't think they like seeing that. Hey, you, I'm going to grab... I'm going to bend down and plant a seed right here. Oh, there goes my head. Pike right through the neck. Alright, so... Villager pretty much useless right now. Check these guys. Tent farmer. That's alright, you can become a miner. You already are a miner, that's right. Ah! Ah! Oh gosh. Not a good uh, sexist joke there. I don't know what's worse, sexism or racism. I don't like either, but uh, that I just had to spew that in there. I'm sorry. Very, very sorry. Apologetic about what I just said there. Alright, so these guys just about ready. Um, send Belita in first if he can ever uh, get out of that building. Jeez, terrible base design. Who designed this base? Was it the? Uh, I don't know of any cities that have terrible uh, city city planning, but I'm sure if I designed a city, it would be one heck of a doozy. All right, uh, I don't know why this is uh, depleted right there. You can uh, go undeplete that because I gotta queue up some more farms. All right, don't be attacking the villagers necessarily. I mean that—that's not—not the key enemy, right? I now they get killed. 
I love seeing the castle pelt some of the villagers lay on their faces. I mean, it's not whale blood, but it is blood, and I need I need some blood. Lahir is very thirsty right now. He's getting a very dry mouth. I hope you realize that. All right, so you're set. Time for you guys to build up your own wall, because um, it's about time we get another wall going over here. And now is the time to build a wall, by the way. And it's preferred that you get a castle over here as well, so we meant to have to reconstruct our base design, remove some of those farms from those rolling hillsides over there, over by Deadly's Catch. And slowly but surely, um, we can get some tech, techs going. You're in a of course you are. And um, I recommend putting a couple guard towers over there because they tend to, persons tend to like to bring in some galleys from time to time and uh, galleys and torpedoes tend to fare pretty well against human flesh. Uh, I don't know what it is, but um, it does. Uh, can't you mine a little bit faster? I guess, I guess that calls for a mining camp upgrade right now. Maybe not. Uh, maybe, actually. Sounds good. We've got plenty of wood, so don't be uh, skimping out on the wood. Bloodlines complete. What are some other researches that don't require any gold? Husbandry. Like the name. You're uh, going to benefit from that. Not. Because you're going to be sold to Mongols. What are you going to do when you get sold to a Mongolian country? You're going to pick some rice? Or are you going to play with your, um, your toy... Cloth and rag dolls. I don't even know what they do. Okay, I'm gonna stop making judgment calls right, like right now. See what happens when there's walls. You usually cannot penetrate the enemy base, but the arrows can penetrate you very nicely, which is uh, quite ironic. Deers, I would get out of there. I really don't understand how they're not completely turned into ripe venison right now. But it's not me to question. Come here, come here. What's wrong? Come a little closer. All right, we'll pull in a Star Fox quote while we're at it. Men at arms, is that an archer firing at my buildings? Ah, uh, we might be in need of a few archers in the road ahead. Uh, I would say no. I don't think we're in need of any more archers. And you can go down with the rest of your bros. And that's it. So um, right about now, we can plot down a mining camp over here and. Um, Looks like the Scythians are coming for a raid of their own pretty soon. And right after the Western Roman Empire is the Scythians, by the way. So uh, be prepared for them. And just in case uh, you run into any difficulties, make sure all your villagers get in here and you don't be picking your nose over there behind the gate. What are you firing at? Oh, I see. Now the Scythians are coming through. You're going to be my allies pretty soon here, so don't waste too many. Alright, don't leave the gate open either, villager. That's not a smart call on your part. Pretty dumb on your part. And don't at do it to any attacking in the Persian uh, mining camp. Just saying. I mean, you don't want to provoke the Persians. I mean, they've got a mighty Don fan over there that's looking to use his uh, rollout on me. And once one gets going, they all get going. Isn't that how it works? Alright, still not enough gold. I mean, Town Watch is probably the most expensive thing I ever bought in my life, apparently. All right, you're you're doing a pretty good job. Pretty soon you want to build another castle over here because the Persians like to sneak some units over there um, from time to time. And with these Tarkins, you can take down some battering rams that the Persians like to send in as well. So we got about a minute left of this running commentary, and um, pretty soon, uh, yeah, I'm gonna sell this, and we're gonna build ourselves a um, castle. And once you drop that off, and I'm going to start building a castle, a behemoth, excuse me, over here. Well, that's not convenient. I'm um, sorry, your farm's going to be destroyed. It's just how it works in the uh, corporate world. Um, and goodbye to the farmlands, and hello. Still not hello? I don't like this. So in the next part... Uh, once I get over this pissed, uh, this bad real estate sitchy, I am going to put a behemoth down and we'll be getting going with the rest of this mission, doing some more defending and resource gathering.